And communication is also a big business in Armenia. For the past few years, the nation's IT industry has been growing rapidly. Now, Armenia TV shows us how this technological development has put the former Soviet Republic and one of its most prominent citizens on the map in a whole new arena. An interactive DVD CD-ROM titled Aram Khachatryan Life and Activity was chosen by a panel of international jurors as the best DVD in the electronic culture category. This DVD is showing uh, not only the biography of Aram Khachaturian, but the life of Armenians in 20th century, including genocide, including the revival, renaissance, and that is very important in our days to understand that the difficulties that as a nation that we are experiencing now are something which is not new in our history. A second Armenian DVD titled The Great Armenian Genocide 1915-1923 was awarded a special diploma in the category of electronic education. The IT industry in Armenia has seen rapid growth in the past few years. IT output reached 1.7% of GDP in 2004, which is a figure that would be typical of countries with a developed IT industry. With uh, new technologies, the world became a village. And within this village, Armenia has a very important role in our heart and in the heart of everybody. Currently, more than 20 foreign countries are importing IT services and products from Armenia, including the USA, Russia, CIS countries and Europe. Leading IT companies like Synopsys, Lycos, Arcatel and Intel are already in Armenia, contributing to Armenia's 30% annual growth in IT. The Armenian Prime Minister Andranik Markaryan says that Armenia has signed an agreement with the WSIS officials stating that Armenia is ready to host a global IT summit as well as a regional award ceremony. For the CNN World Report, Rubina Markosyan, Armenia TV.